Hi, and welcome back to the Petersville Farm channel. Today, I want to share some essential tips on maintaining your precious tomatoes. Remember, there's no such thing as self maintenance when it comes to gardening. Let's get right into it. As you can see, I've been diligently checking our tomato plants for any signs of trouble. Recently, Caleb and Abigail did a fantastic job removing pesky black worm infestations. Great teamwork, guys. Today, I'll be keeping an eye out for pests, especially the notorious tomato hornworms. These Little guys can wreak havoc on our plants, so daily inspections are crucial. And, uh, you know, they normally, uh, tomato worms, they are sneaky and hard to spot, but they leave clues like eating leaves and droppings around the plant base. They're quite large caterpillars with horn like tails and they absolutely love tomatoes. So here is one of them that I found. This is in the smaller stage, but they grow pretty quickly. But as a result of uh, the leaves um, and uh, the eating up leaves and the droppings, I was able to, to detect them. And you can actually see droppings around the base of the roots. So all those are signs of their presence and that will help. So here we can see the droppings and uh, that will help us to diligently or persistently uh, stay around until we could spot them. If you come across a hornworm covered in the white rice-like organism, don't panic. It's a good sign that nature is taking care of the situation thanks to helpful parasitic wasp. Another issue to watch out for is um, the blossom end rot. It's caused by a calcium deficiency in the plant, leading to those unsightly brown spots on the bottom of the tomatoes. But it can also happen if the plant can't absorb the existing calcium in the soil due to water problems like um, heavy drought or heavy rainfall. Okay, so thankfully, overall, we're not seeing much attack from the pest or disease at the moment in this location, uh, like those pesky block spots on the leaves. Regular monitoring will help to catch such problems early on and um, oh don't forget some tomato plants need extra support as they grow so i'll be gently tying up um, branches to keep everything nice and tidy that's it for today um, for today's tomato care tips i hope you found them helpful if you did give this video a thumbs up and share it with your fellow gardeners. Also, let us know in the comments if you have any more tips to add. Happy gardening, and I'll see you next time. Bye.